slope style is a mixture of jumps, rails, um, and all combined in a fluid, I guess, obstacle course. <laughs> um, it varies. Every course you ride is different. So yeah, you just select what features you want. Um, some are harder than others, and you go through, get tricky, um, hit the jumps, do your tricks, um, and roll out. Generally they'll go, you know, a rail to begin with, maybe another one. Uh, all varying types, whether there's stairs or ledges or down flat downs. Um, and generally you'll go into a jump section where there will be three, four jumps depending um, on the slope and then it might end with another rail. Personally, I'm not that tricky on the rails, <laughs> but some people get, um, you know, quite adventurous on the rails, um, you know, spinning on, flipping off, um, you know, anything. But um, the boys, um, they are quite impressive these days on the slope course. As long as the jumps are big enough and built well enough, um, you'll definitely see some triple corks, I reckon. Um, but that's all depending on, you know, if the jumps are big enough. I know at World Championships, Mark McMorris just said they're not big enough for a triple. So, um, yeah, just it all depends on the course, really, of what the what the riders will pull out. Um, yeah. And what makes a good rider in slope style? Style, smoothness, um, and then the combination of rails and jumps. It's judged on uh, technicality, overall impression, combination of everything. And once you drop in, you are being critiqued from top to bottom. Yeah.